Hello and welcome to Wars Game In. Today I'm going to mention top 5 mystery games to play this November. Starting with number 1, we got the Dark Pictures Anthology The Devil in Me. The Dark Pictures Anthology The Devil in Me is a mystery adventure psychological horror game developed by Supermassive Games and published by Bandai Namco Entertainment. It was released recently on 18th November on PlayStation 4 and 5, Xbox One, Xbox Series X and S, and Microsoft Windows via Steam. It is the fourth installment and the final installment of Season 1 in the Dark Pictures Anthology, after Man of Medan in 2019, Little Hope in 2020, and House of Ashes in 2021. Like earlier games in the series, The Devil in Me features a cast of five playable protagonists and a multiplayer narrative influenced by player choice. The game's decision-making scenes, of which there are several, can significantly alter the trajectory of the plot and change the relationships between the main characters. Due to these choices, any of the five protagonists can die permanently. So in this game, a group of documentary filmmakers receive a mysterious call inviting them to a modern day replica of serial killer H. H. Holmes' murder castle. It's an opportunity that they cannot ignore because it could provide them with the fame and public interest they ever wished for. But on arrival, as they film their latest episode, the crew soon discovers that they are being watched and even manipulated by a torturous evil monster who is determined on becoming America's deadliest serial killer. On number 2 we got Pentiment. Pentiment is a single player mystery detective adventure and exploration game developed by Obsidian Entertainment and published by Xbox Game Studios. It was released recently on 15th November on Windows via Steam, Xbox One, and Xbox Series S and X. The game sets in Bavaria in 16th century, a time when Europe is at crossroads of great religious and political change. You play as Andreas Mailer, a master artist who finds himself in the middle of murders, scandals, and mystery in Bavarian Alps. The game environment is very artistic inspired by great illuminated manuscripts and the earliest printed books. Uncover mysteries by choosing different academic and social backgrounds and meet a colorful cast of characters as you discover the stories and secrets that lie within the small Bavarian town of Tassing. In an era of great religious and political change, each decision you make can have a profound impact on the community's future. Find your own way through this turbulent time and see the consequences of your choices play out over generations. On number 3 we got The Past Within. The Past Within is a co-op multiplayer puzzle and mystery indie game developed and published by Rusty Lake. It was released on 2nd November 2022. This co-op gameplay is split with one player in the past and the other in the future. So team up with a friend and piece together the mystery surrounding Albert Van Der Boom, a member of the Van Der Boom clan. Communicate with what you see around yourself to help one another solve various puzzles and explore the worlds from different perspectives, meaning both players will experience their environments in two different dimensions, 2D as well as in 3D. It has cross-platform play, so as long as you can communicate with each other, you and your partner of choice can each play the past within on your preferred platform, that is on PC, Mac, iPhone operating systems, Android, and Nintendo Switch. The game has two chapters with average playtime of two hours, but has a replayability feature which lets you replay the game from other perspectives that would lead you to new solutions to all puzzles. Moving on to number 4 we got Signalis. Signalis is a single player survival horror mystery sci-fi game developed by Rose Engine and published by Humble Games and Playism. It was released on 27th October 2022 on Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Xbox Series X and S, and Microsoft Windows via Steam. Signalis is set in a dystopian future where humanity has colonized the solar system and the totalitarian regime of Yuzan nation maintains an iron grip through aggressive surveillance and propaganda. Humanoid androids known as replicas live among the populace, acting as workers and civil servants. The story of Signalis begins with a replica named Elster, who awakens from a cryostasis in a wrecked vessel. Now stranded on a cold planet, 
she sets out on a journey into depths unknown to find her ship's only pilot and her partner Ariane, who has gone missing mysteriously. She explores the dim corners of an abandoned spaceship and underground mining facility where she finds that most of the inhabitants have gone insane due to a breakout of a strange disease which sickened humans and turned most of the local replicas into horrific disfigured monsters, and Elster must traverse through these hostile areas to continue her search. And while doing so, she inadvertently unravels a government conspiracy of potentially cosmic horror proportions. Signalis has a lot of interesting puzzles which gets harder as Elster moves more into the depth of the story. I have also done a separate brief review on Signalis. I will mention the link on description if you want to check it out. Highly recommend it. And finally on number 5 we got the case of the golden idol. The Case of the Golden Idol is a single-player mystery detective investigation game developed by Color Grey Games and published by Playstack. It was released on 13th October 2022 on Microsoft Windows via Steam. In this game, you step into the shoes of an 18th century detective and uncover the mystery behind 12 strange deaths spanning 40 years, all somehow connected. You as a detective need to unmask the true killers in this sprawling narrative and discover their devious motives. Observe closely and reconstruct each scene of death. Your skills of deduction can identify each suspect, motive and murder weapon. Uncover the conspiracy by revealing the true nature of the mysterious golden idol and those who covet it. Follow the journey of a cursed aristocratic family as you untangle a web of deceit and villainy in your hunt for the truth behind this dark conspiracy. So that was my top 5 recommendations of mystery games to play this November. Let me know if you found this helpful and interesting. If you did, please like, share and subscribe and mention in the comment your recommendations as well. I will see you again soon with more content.